Ladies and gentlemen, the main attraction race. Competition is a powerful thing. I think I could beat you. Jessica, you can't beat me. Believe me. That this was all fun and games up until this point. I didn't know the duck dorks were flipping burgers now. Now the gloves are off. You're going down, big girl, with your pink on. Some people have it. Now we've got a burst of ball here. Hips. It's kind of embarrassing. Some don't. No! I'm not hurt. It's easy in life to let your competitive nature get the best of you. Phil, I'm in. The Robertsons are a proud and confident breed. Are we ready to rumble? <laughs> oh, something smelling delicious here. We're having our big sister club. I got another club for you to join, the health club. That's part of the reason why Jessica's here. We're going bowling. You what? You're just not exercise, K. You run down that thing and throw that ball. You take four steps and you throw no, a ball. No, I have little steps. I take six or seven. <laughs> Why don't you come bowling with us? You can join our big sister club. I think I could beat you. Jessica, you can't beat me. Believe me. Want to bet? I got $200 on this girl. You're going to bet $200 on her? Bop, 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 bop. Well, he can come to a chicken calling. All right. Bring your checkbook. Hey, I got cash. What? Cash. What? <laughs> what is she he doing here? What are already? you doing here? Willie, you cannot be practicing this early, okay? Y'all didn't say what time to get here. We're gonna have two teams. No. Yeah. This was one on one. You said you were betting on her against me. This was the whole point for them to get active. All right, well, I'm picking teams. No, 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 no. You were here practicing early, so I get to choose the first. All right, I definitely got Crystal, because she played basketball. Who's the best out of you two? I got Carpal Tunnel. All right, you're out. Rhonda, you're on my team. Willie, you got Kay and Carpal Girl. All right, I've got the challenge section, I guess. All right, big sisters. Play by the rules, no cheating. I want to pick which side, because I got a lucky number. It doesn't matter which lane Look, you're Look, number 10, that was Daddy's number. It's my lucky number. All right, fine. You can play on 10. You pretend like your daddy when he played football. All right. Suck we'll in your stomach. <laughs> <laughs> See, nobody thought exercise would be this much fun. Barring some miracle, I'm going to have to carry my team to victory. We're not exercising. Plus, you've got, like, 20 bags of chips there. <laughs> Thankfully, that's just a metaphor, because that may be a little rough on the knees. OK, Xena the Warrior Princess. All right. $200 on this. Don't screw it up. There you go, Come on, Jessica. Jessica. <laughs> I can't hear y'all, man. All right, Frito Pie on 10. OK, you're halfway down the lane. Kay got zero, shocker. I love you, Miss Kay. It's not so much that I have confidence in me or my team. Oh, crap. <laughs> Gutter ball. It's just that I have zero confidence in Willie's team. All right, Willow. Come on, Willow. Oh, oh God. Oh, golly, are you kidding me? Amateur hour. May the worst team lose. Come on, you got this. No! Oh! <laughs> Are you all I'm right? not hurt. I'm not hurt. Here's the good news. That's the best ball you threw. Well, oh! that's the good news. I'm gonna have to finish her bowl. What? Her, her knees hurt. She all can't run. Right, you're out too. I'm gonna finish her bowl. There you go. <laughs> well, how many pins did I get? You got all of them, but two. Good job, Kay. Woo! Kay's doing awesome now. I hate to say it, but something about my mom hurting herself really got my game going again. Yes! Woo! That was me. Kay, you're on fire. All right, it all comes down to this. I'm ahead by one pin. One pin. That's it, ladies. One Come pin. On, Zena. Are you scared, Willie? You're scared I'm going to beat you? No, I'm winning. I'm not scared at all. Whatever. You're just gonna put all your weight in it. She don't have any weight to put in it. 
Think about dinner. Woo! performance I've ever seen. She choked. She choked me. Boom! Well, I may not have bowled my best game, but when you have an opponent like Jessica, sometimes your worst is good enough. At the end of the day, it's all about good, clean fun. And 200 bucks. So, pay up. You can ask your mom for that. She's the one to put the money up. Well, here's the best option on that. What's better than $200? Normally, I'd feel bad about taking $200 from my mother, but not today. 200 cupcakes. I don't want 200 cupcakes. That's because she's giving me 200 cupcakes instead. Share with the neighborhood. He needs to share that shirt with somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> don't eat all those cupcakes yourself, Willow. Crash it! Dad! Practice serves. Anytime. Willie. Spread your wings like an eagle. Don't talk in the middle That's of my serve. Not... Little one. You need to turn into an eagle. I've never heard anybody say do eagle on serving. You've never had a professional lesson. Hey, are we going to play? OK, we're loose. I'm really happy that Jolly and Mary Kate decided to play couples tennis with us, but I'm a little bit concerned that Willie could be taking the competition a little too seriously. Ew. Cliff. <laughs> John Luke may be used to his dad's competitive spirit. No pressure, Mary Kate. Oh my gosh. But I think he could actually be scaring Mary Kate. Oh! Like a little mouse coming to the cobra. What is the cobra? It's me coming up behind the net. Willie may think he's teaching them a lesson about marriage and tennis. The cobra, the eagle. That's how you teach. And cobras and eagles. But the only thing they're actually learning is how not to act on a tennis court. And the old people win. Well, another one we've won. Two, zero. All right, I know what y'all are going through. You think it's over. But this is a good lesson. Just like in marriage, you have to stick with it. See, your mom, she's kind of an old tennis player, but we play together as a team, and basically are kicking y'all's butts, and y'all should be embarrassed. You get the lesson? OK, you just said I'm old, and they should be embarrassed. It was a little fuzzy. They should be embarrassed. I said you're an that older tennis player. is not encouraged. John Luke, do you get the lesson? I got it. Let's play some tennis. All right, John Luke, we got this. Oh, you don't have this, Mary Kate. I'm doing this out of love. The bigger the beatdown Corey and I serve up, uh -oh, go. the more they're going to have to learn to work as a team and gain the necessary skills for marriage. You just stand in there? Don't hit it to him at the net. Good job. Good night. Skills like communication. You need some oxygen? Maybe we can get you on those tanks. I'm running all over the court. You're just standing up there. Admitting when you're wrong. Nope. How far? Really? It was out by a mile, Dad. Being supportive. Nah. Wow. I think the eagle was sleeping on that one. And complimenting each other's weaknesses. Crap. Oh! Sadie. If you'd actually hit the ball in, she'll stop calling it out. <laughs> Willie. One day, they're going to look back at this butt kicking. That's game. Two to one. And thank me for my coaching, on and off the court. <sighs> Serve the ball. The only person learning a lesson here is Willie. Oh. Always stretch before physical activity. About to pass out here. You can ice it later. Come on. <sighs> oh. Oh. You got it. Oh. You got it. Yours. Yours. Oh. Oh, Damn. oh game. Ooh. Set match the elders. Ugh. <sighs> Look, I may not be able to lift my arm for a week or two, but beating them two youngsters made it all worth it. And it was also nice teaching them about marriage and stuff like that. Mm. Excuse me, sir, don't lean on the net. You just gotta struggle through the pain. It's just like marriage. You gotta... Mm. 
and uh, work as a team. Good game, kids. Good match. Good match. Being the entrepreneur that I am, I recently opened my own family restaurant called Willie's Duck Diner. I just landed your diner, the title sponsor on the racing circuit. Are you kidding? I did that for you because I thought, well, he's got a diner. I love race cars. Well, it's not cars. Well, then what are we racing? Racing outhouses. Oh, my gosh. You know, this thing actually looks faster it's once, fast. we, once we got I'm it on the concrete. It's fast. Look. You want me to tell you how fast it's oh, going to be? Oh, can't work. Oh. 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 Let's go, baby. What was that going? What are you doing? That was a chest bump. That's pitiful. The attack of the walrus. Y'all get my helmet on, boys. It's back. I said a safety helmet, sir. No. You just said helmet. Driver shall wear safety helmets. No problem. Driver has helmet on and is ready to race. Go! Nope. All, right. All right, here we go. Easy, uh, easy. All right, turn it. Oh, boy, this thing is moving. All right. All right. Now, turn it again, boy. Oh. Here we go. Now, turn oh, it again. Gosh, hey, boy. hey, stop it, thing. Stop it, thing. It's a break. Uh-oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, get me out of this piece of junk. Look. There's so many opportunities to go out in a blaze of glory. Hey! Going out in a racing toilet, that ain't at the top of my list, OK? Stop, sir! He almost ran in that pit. Hey, open this door before I kick it off. <laughs> Give me out of this piece of junk. You know, F-18 jet fighter, fully combat loaded. Now, that would be OK. Good grief, boys. But, hey, yeah, how did he die? Oh, he, uh, he got killed in a racing a toilet. Oh, really? Yeah. No. I can't tell what we got here. Mr. T or CeeLo Green. <laughs> Can you sing? That's funny, sir. Real well, look, funny. Hey, you can't race. I know that already. Last time I lost by a technicality. Philip McMillan's having engine trouble. <laughs> Boom! Chest <laughs> up. You lost, didn't but you? You lost. Hey, you lost. That's the you point. You win some, you lose some. Today, I win some. Let's go, boys. Go get them, boys. All right. All right. Woo! There it is. We got it. Woo! Woo-hoo! Let's go, He's passing him now. Go across the line first. You're never gonna let this down. To be so close to victory, only to have it ripped out of your hands at the last second by a pudgy, Ugh. yellow wig wearing man in Crocs, it's just downright embarrassing. You lose this time. Well, you get free food for a year. Compliments, Willie's Diner. And his specialty is bologna sandwich. Bologna? Congratulations. <laughs> I love bologna. Thank Enjoy. you, man. Hey, you like bologna's bologna? my favorite. Starting to like you better already. Yeah, and it's free. Hey, oh, what, what are we doing? Sucker. Thank you for the bologna, Will. Shut up. Every year in these parts, we have outhouse races. People come from miles around just to watch, simply for the fact that there are men and women riding on a mobile toilet chasing victory. It's quite the community gathering. So if you're gonna have an outhouse and you're gonna race it, why not make the name of the outhouse the greatest bowel movement conceivable? Turnip greens. Why did you call it turnip greens? They produce the greatest bowel movement oh, ever. Fastest movement in the West. Speaking of turds. Philip McMillian. Yeah, he's back. Uh-oh, headache, headache. Get that dump truck ready. Get out there on that white line, and let's get it on. Technically, all outhouses are dump trucks. That one's a turnip dump. That don't even make sense. That's funny.
Philip gets his trash talking from the same place he gets his personal hygiene, from parts unknown. Let's go, guys. Turn up dump. All I can think about is taking him down. Let's go, boys. Let's go get him, boys. As we're racing, what's going through my head is that I'm winning. I'm in a box. I can't see. I don't have rear view mirrors. I don't see my opponent ahead of me. <laughs> when I found out that Philip won the race, I was shocked because I just did not see Philip ahead of me at any point in the race. This is not the conclusion. This is just another chapter in the book of competing with my nemesis. Winner, your mom and him. What's up? Wow, Jess. good job. Good, good job, game. Jess. Pulled it off. I didn't know adults did that. Oh, my goodness. Uh, what is going on with the duck boys? Why am I not surprised? What happened? Did the flute factory fall apart? What happened? They only had medium shirts? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Missed an eye there. McMillan's villains. It's a, it's a play on words. Well, y'all may want to put a team together. We'll play you. I don't know if you guys are in shape to play. I mean, Willie's not very good at dodging biscuits. Gravy. That's very true. No, he's not good at dodging. You may get hurt if you keep running your mouth like that. We'll meet you out on the court. This is his hardest throw right there. Yeah. Oh! Ooh. Phil, That's I'm in. For you. That's gonna cost you. Oh, God. These will be the practice balls. We've got a big dodgeball match coming up that will settle this rivalry with Phil McMillan once and for all. So I want our team to be in tip-top condition. Uh, that's terrible. 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 Woo! Terrible. 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 Compliments are for losers. That's why I'm choosing to motivate them through negative reinforcement. Oh, yes. I was distracted. Work on your form. My hands are sweaty. Let's go. Ooh. You're out. Focus. If you want your team to win, you need to let them know all the things they're doing wrong. I'm much better in a game. Yeah. I'm better at dodging. And right now, that's pretty much everything. Y'all are horrible. Fire at will. Who's the What? My ankle is hurting. What? From yesterday? My ankle's hurting. I mean, as much as I want to do this, I you just don't want to do it. Do why you? don't I bail and let Cole come in? Fine. All right. Okay, really? Yeah. Well, you look fine now. All right, Missy's out. What? What's wrong? Sweet. The good news is we got Cole. All right, you want to do some stretching? We've been stretching. Uh, he stretches forever. Now, we've got a versatile ball here. So, let's work on the hips. Hips. That looks inappropriate. Uh, and here they are. Uh, what are you doing? What'd that ball do to you? Uh, what, do you got to deal with Tom Brady? I'm stretching, son. I've never stretched in my life. You're stretching that shirt out. This is what we're supposed to wear when you play D-ball. All right. Do y'all need to stretch? Brother, I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it to service on Sunday, so uh, can you put this in the plate for me? I see that. Let's keep it fair. He's a preacher. Keep he it can't fair. Cheer. He's just going to keep it fair. Are we ready to rumble? Yes. Just as I expected, all those hearty meals at the Duck Diner have not helped Phil's dodgeball game. Dang, I should have caught that ball. Dang. I did not expect, however, to be playing against a military sniper. Oh, shoot. Corey, out. 
I mean, if this guy can hit a moving target a mile away from the top of a Humvee, he's gonna make quick work of six idiots standing about 10 feet in front of him. Ah! Oh! Uh -oh. Watch out, watch out, Kyle, watch out. You're out. I should have just challenged Phil to a game of bowling. It's one on one now. Come on, Cole. Yeah. Yes. Oh. Get him, Josh. Good job, Josh. Get, 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 get him. Hey, don't hurt my baby. Get me. <laughs> We might have lost to Philip McMillan in the past while riding a toilet, but not today. I think I will be at church tomorrow to... No refunds there, bud. <laughs> but I will be glad to see you at church. Today we ascend on the throne of victory. <laughs> <laughs>